So a few months ago, I made a video about how it's possible to dramatically improve your FPS in Minecraft. This video did quite well, for the record, and recently I've been seeing a ton of comments asking how I optimize my Minecraft. So in today's video, I will be bringing you guys with a long-awaited tutorial of how you can improve your FPS in Minecraft, and maybe in some ways double or triple your FPS. However, I cannot guarantee you guys will get the same margin of results, but either way, I am completely confident that this will help, if not most of you guys out. So anyways, let's get into the video. Alright guys, so first of all, we are going to start off with some very, very basic, very basic stuff, and that is download, download Optifine. Believe me, download Optifine, it will get you tons more FPS if you haven't already. Yeah, make sure you download Optifine. Please. It doesn't matter if you are a PvP -er or like someone who plays on like 1.14, like the latest version. Make sure you have Optifine. It's very useful and it gives you a ton more FPS. And yeah, that's that's the first that's the first tip out the way. All right, guys. So for the second step, we are gonna go over some Minecraft settings. So what I want you guys to do is I want you guys to press Options, Video Settings, and just copy down these settings which I have here. And yeah, you can pause the video if you have to, but all I want you guys to do is copy down these. And once you've done that, you're good to go. You'll probably get a huge FPS increase. Alright guys, so this next step involves you changing some Windows settings. Don't worry, I know a lot about Windows, but if you are on Mac, I am very sorry. I don't know anything about Mac. I've never owned a Mac in my entire life. So basically, what you want to do is you want to click here, you just want to left click, type in Power Options. Or just power. Hold on. Yeah, you just want to just type in power. You come up with something like this. You just want to click it. You want to go to power options. And then you just want to make sure it is on, like, ultimate performance. Or it's, like, if you don't have this option or if you don't have high performance. What you want to do is you want to click create a power plan. You want to make sure it's on high performance. You can name it whatever you want. You can name it, like, I don't know, Shrek. Uh, and then, yeah, you can just change it however you want. And then you click create. And then you have Shrek. And yeah, that's basically all to it. Let's move on to the next step. Alright, so the next step to getting more FPS in Minecraft is overclocking. Overclocking your GPU or CPU can give you a tremendous amount of FPS. And although I am not covering it in this video, I just want you guys to know that it definitely does help you out a ton. It helped me out a ton. And I can definitely say that it does make a pretty big difference. And I have benchmarked and I have seen a huge difference in overclocking. Now, I know a lot of you already know what PvP clients are and how much they improve your FPS, but equally the same amount of people don't know how much these clients actually do improve your FPS. So here I have Luna Client. Now, Luna Client is a mod pack and client side anti cheat for Minecraft 1.7.10 and of course 1.8.9. So, although these clients are more PvP orientated and to the PvP community, they do have countless features and they do improve your FPS, as you can see here. Alright guys, so we have Badline Client, and Badline Client does work with the newer versions of Minecraft, so you can also play with the newer versions of Minecraft on Badline Client and still get a huge FPS gain. And of course we have Hyperion. Now Hyperion, to an extent, does improve your FPS. I do believe it's not as much as Luna Client, but it does improve your FPS. And of course we have PvP Lounge, which comes with both the same versions as Luna Client does, and it also does improve your FPS quite a lot too. Alright guys, so this next step involves you needing a NVIDIA graphics card, and basically what you want to do is you just want to right click anywhere on your desktop, and it's going to come up with this NVIDIA control panel. So what you want to do is you just want to click any moment now, there we go, okay, so this comes up basically, and all you have to do is you just want to click on manage 3D settings. All you guys have to do is basically copy down these settings, which I have here, and yeah, you should be good. Definitely make sure you have this option enabled, because it really increased my FPS, and when I saw this, it was a life changer. So yeah, make sure you definitely have this setting on if you have it. Alright guys, so this next step involves you going to adjust image settings with preview and you just want to click on performance. Yeah, just click performance, but it definitely does increase your FPS and I have seen it. It definitely does. And yeah, it'll help you. Alright guys, so I'm going to show you guys how to add more RAM to Minecraft because believe it or not, adding more RAM to Minecraft definitely increases your FPS and your performance as well. So basically, I'm going to show you guys how to do this on Lunar Client, Badline Client and even the normal Minecraft launcher. What you want to do for Lunar Client is you just want to open up the launcher. You want to open up Lunar Client Launcher. 
Once you're on the launcher, all you have to do is click settings and basically, I don't know, allocate like a third or half of your RAM. So for an example, I have 16 gigs, so I can allocate maybe like 8 gig, or if I'm not going to allocate as much, I'll use like 6 gigs or maybe 4.5. Basically, fine tune this so it's somewhere around here, and you should have a good time. Okay, so for bad line client, it's just as easy. So all you have to do is you want to click on this, and once you do this, you want to go to settings. And here's where you can basically do the same thing. So you can allocate as much RAM as you want. But again, I would only allocate maybe, I don't know, maybe 3 gigs or maybe 5 gigs. And if you only have like 4 gigs of RAM, I would definitely recommend only using like 2 or 1 gigs of RAM. Now it's a bit more difficult with the normal Minecraft launcher, but believe me, it's basically the same deal. So you want to go to installations and then you want to go to your version of Minecraft. Once you do this, you want to go to more options, and then you can change this little value here. It's a bit more difficult with this because you don't really get a slider, which is way easier to do. But basically, what you want to do is you want to change this to maybe like a half or third of your RAM. So say if you have 16 gigs of RAM, I would recommend setting this to maybe like 7 or 8 gigs. So say if you already have 4 gigs of RAM, I would recommend you only setting this to like 2 gigs. But say if you have 8 gigs of RAM, I would recommend setting this to maybe like 3 gigs or even 4 gigs. And that's how you allocate more RAM to Minecraft. And lastly, I wanted to get into OBS because here's something which really helped me out a ton. So basically, if you use OBS to record and whenever you record it completely kills your FPS, basically what you can do is disable the preview. So normally, you'll get something which looks like this. Basically, what you can do is you can right click and then disable the preview, which actually does increase your FPS loads because it's trying to give you 540 FPS as a preview, especially if you try and record in high FPS. Yeah, if you use OBS, definitely disable the preview whilst you're recording. And yeah, that's pretty much about it. Alright guys, so I'm going to end the video here because I have included a ton of tips for you guys and I don't know how many more I could fit in this video, but you know, if you do want to see more tips, I have a ton more tips which I can show you guys about how to get more FPS. But yeah, if you did enjoy this video, consider subscribing. Thank you so much for watching. This has been Guinea, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.